Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Warren's Let's Plays. Today, guys, I'm bringing to you a brand new game that just recently dropped on Game Pass called Vampire Survivors. You know, I'm all about some Vampire Survivors because I'm a huge horror fan, so I'm super excited about this. And to let you guys know, uh, my homeboy over there at WrestleRoney uh, Plus Podcast, be sure to check him out for all the wrestling indie news you're looking for, interviews with great wrestlers. Also, Shameless plug, your boy Lawrence is also a co-host over there. My boy Spooky Lou Carpenbarker told me this game was coming out. He'd been playing it through Steam. He absolutely loves it. He said, dude, wait till you see it. It's coming out on Game Pass. You're a fan of roguelikes, which I am. And he said, you're going to love this game. So Spooky Lou, my brother, thank you so much for telling me about this game. This is what we'll be playing today. To my returning viewers, thanks so much for your continued support. If you're new to the channel, thank you so much as well for stopping by. Uh, guys, do like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Become one of Lawrence's legends as we're sitting at 101 subs. Just got another one recently. Thank you so much. I apologize. I did not see your name fast enough. Thank you so much for the kind words and for your sub. Nothing left to say. I'm Lawrence, and let's play. So let's check this bad boy out. Vampire Survivors. Come on, let's get it. Horror roguelike? Sign me up. Let's go. Daily quest ready to turn and play Game Pass. I don't care about it. none of that shit. Let's go. Collection start unlocks. Okay. I will say I don't know much about this other than uh, what my boy Spooky Lou is kind of hyped up about the game. Okay, we got a character select Antonio, Amelda. Pascalina Gennaro. Okay, Antonio gains 10% more damage every 10 levels. Max plus 50%. I like it. Dude, he so looks like Simon Belmont. Imelda gains 10% more experience every 5 levels. Max plus 30%. Pascalina projectiles get 10% faster every 5 levels. Max plus 3%. Gennaro. Permanent plus 1 projectile all weapons. You know, we're going to select my man Antonio. Let's get it. Oh, we're gonna need those. Come on. Come on, let's get it. Get him, Simon Belmont. Don't front game. You know that Simon Belmont. Dude, did I die already? What just happened? King Bible. Oh, I get a selection. Uh, orbits around the curve. High damage, high area scaling. Santa Water generates damage and damaging zones. Let's get with orbits around the character. Um, about to select something? Oh, okay. There's bro. Are you serious right now? That is so ripped from Castlevania. That is so ripped from Castlevania. Tell me that is not the Castlevania book flying around like from Symphony of the Night. Okay. Only one downside, my man Spooky. This game starts out slow, bro. High damage, high area scaling, fires one more projectile. All right. Let's get that. And just so you know, and we're on the same page, guys, I'm always happy to, you know, Give some shine to an indie dev. You know, it, it, it's not going to be all about like triple A games on my channel. I play everything and anything and everything. I think it's going to be interesting. I'm playing that shit. We are going to go over here though. Get a, get a little space. Okay, so I see what's going on. So the blue meter is building up, and then when I get so many of these things, whoa, hey, don't die. Uh, that's going to give me the chance to upgrade again. Bro, where's my speed your slow ass up button? Or uh, power up, because my man is slow. You are slow, bro. You like that Pokemon slow, bro. It takes a, oh, is that gold or something? Yeah. It takes a hot minute for me to 
Level that bar up, y'all. Obviously, this shit's gonna get tougher. Whoa! Look at the bats! It's like a flock of bats. I guess, is that what you call? What do you, I don't know. What the hell you call, like, a whole bunch of bats? Make sure to leave a comment and let me know, because I, I honestly don't know. I don't know a lot about the uh, animal kingdom. What the hell do you call, like, a, a, a gathering of bats? I don't know, is it a flock? Uh, fires quickly in the face direction spinach. Raises inflicted damage by 10%. Increase your luck for a chance to get four choices. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go spinach. Whoa, that is a lot of bats, yo! Yo! What's up with all them bats? With all this, with all this health damage I'm taking, too. Oh my god. My man, you are slower than molasses! All this damage I'm taking! I will throw the holy book at your ass. You know I will. Oh, dude, that's like a super bat. Whoa, get the hell out of there, bro. Bro, this shit's getting real. Getting real deal holy filled right here. Okay, so far, I'm liking this. I'm not gonna lie, this is alright. You know they're gonna take more damage to go down. Give me that. Generates damaging zones, all base damage up 10%, high damage, high area scaling. Hmm. All base damage. Let's generate damaging zones. Whoa, bro. Bro, bro. Bro, bro. I'm digging this that I can like look in one direction and still attack you from behind. That's good. Good up. Currently level five. Come on. Kill that big bat. Whoa, bro. Bro, are you serious? How are you not dead? Why are there so many damn skeletons? These guys obviously have a lot more health. Yo, and when do I get help? Bro, when do I get some Whoa, ghost? Aha, no shot, you dead. You dead, bitch! Ah! Ah! Yo, is this, like, infinite? Can I just, like, run in one direction forever? How about you ghosts? What about killing you and getting them orbs, though? Oh, yeah, I'm liking this. I am definitely liking this game. But I need you to be a little faster, my dude. I wonder if that book's picking up, uh, like, the power-up shit, man. Oh. Can I get some more speed? Don't forget all the extra damage I'm doing. Where's the... Get your ass a lot faster than you are. Whoa, what is this? Oh, can I actually get by that? I can't. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. I can't kill that bad one hit! Okay. okay, we got ghouls. We got all kinds of crazy shit coming out now, guys. Yo, does this stuff just stay on the screen for me? That'd be great. Oh, what the hell happened? I got trapped in here. Oh, no, 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 no. Get the hell out of here, bro. Wait, is that what they meant by the zones? Yo, I thought that was supposed to be to my benefit. Not trap my ass in with a bunch of little shop, little shop of horror plants. What the hell was that? Or is that what's going on? Is that what's going on? Is it randomly? Okay. That's what's going on. That was just a game mechanic where it just decides to just trap your ass in again. Or trap your ass in, I guess. Okay. Cool. Cool, yeah. Yikes! 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 
Not sure I understand the name of the game. Vampire Saver? Oh, I'm sorry, Vampire Survivors. You want to call it Vampire Saver? I've never heard it before, Vampire Saver. Oh, yeah, that's, uh... That is the name of one of the classic... Uh, Capcom fighting game franchises, Dark, uh, Darkstalkers. Which, even though it was made by Capcom, to be honest, it's kind of like a... In my opinion, it's like a poor man's, um, Street Fighter. I mean, hell, there's even a vampire, or Dimitri, I believe his name was, that literally has, like, Rue and Ken's move. Yeah. Okay, so that's what it's doing. It's, whoa, my dude, though. Whoa, with the bats, though. With the bats, though. Yo. Just, just like that? That's how you go treat me. Reach level five. Let's get an achievement. Hollow heart. Survive one minute with any character. Well, yeah, that wasn't hard. Reach level five. Got it. Oh, cool. Nice little detailed stats here. I dig it. All right, another achievement. Wings. What was that about? Reach level five. So, Mad Forest normal. Gold times one. Survive for seven minutes and seven seconds. Gold earned four. Level reach five. Enemies defeated 525. Weapon whip got to level two. Damage 6k. Times 107. DPS 14. King Bible. Santa water. All right. Excuse me. Two unlocks. All right. Yo, what I unlock? Level five. Oh, are the, are the, are the unlocks? What? Where's the second one? Oh, survival. One. Okay. So the unlocks, AKA, are the achievements. Got it. Nope. I won't do that. Collection shows the stuff I got. Oh man, you got 126 things to collect. Okay, um, this is gonna be a game that you're gonna be investing some time in for sure. Refund power-ups. Ah, raises inflicted damage. Okay, I see you. I see you, vampire survivors. Gains 10% more experience every five levels. Projectiles get 10% faster every five levels. Permanent plus one projectile weapons. I think we're gonna go with a Melda. Oh, I gotta unlock a Melda. Shit. Well, that's booty. All right, we're gonna run this bad boy back. We are gonna run this bad boy back right here. And in the, in the early going, I'm gonna make sure to pick up all these damn blue things. That's kind of important. Get wrecked. Oh, get wrecked. Get all together in a row, son. Level up. Shields from damage when active. Fires at the nearest enemy. Fires quickly in the face direction. Yo, let's go with the knife. What do you guys think? We'll go with the knife. Why not? Yeah. Get knife, bitch! Oh, I like that. Oh, and then... Okay. Whatever direction I face, huh? Got it. Yeah, I'm liking this. Like I said, it's always it's always good to you know show, shed a little bit of love, you know, so shine a little light on like indie devs, man. Like these guys, you know, gals, they work just as hard as you know triple A devs. So you know, make sure to support your indie game scene. It's like supporting like your indie wrestling. Make sure you're supporting your indie devs, because like I said, these guys work just as hard as triple A's. And some of these games are just crazy. Like, you know, playing games where like one person created the game. Like, that's insane. Uh, that, that's a uh, love and a dedication to your craft, for sure. Uh-huh, yeah. What's up now? Oh, I found a treasure! What'd I get? What'd I get? What'd I get? Bunch of gold. And is that like an upgrade to my throwy knife? Yes, it is. Oh, oh I got two knives. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. Oh. Oh, dude, it's like Castlevania where you like you bust open like the the lamps and shit. You know what I mean? You get the moves ten percent faster. Yes. You definitely want that. My man is slow. You bamboozle me, Spiggy Lou! 
I had no idea that the character was so slow. A fun game, but man, I wish he was faster. But okay. Nice to see that we do eventually get speed power-ups. Nice, nice, nice. I'll be taking all those, thank you. Yo, it's the swarm of bats! Yo! Let's get max health by 20%. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Man, I just got wrecked, son! Yo, don't come back this way, bats. Yo! Bats! Oh, y'all want some of this? Y'all want some of this? Yo, what is this? What is this? Yo! Oh, yo, freeze frame! Yo, I turned these bitches into the Matrix! Come on, baby! Y'all got Matrix! Matrix them fools. Okay, I need to start collecting coins. That's on the, that's on the real. That's important. Oh, I can't destroy those. Then. Okay. I got you, game. I got you, game. Yeah, make sure if you're uh, you know, checking this game out with me, you guys leave a comment. Let me know what you think about this, man. I, I'm I'm really liking this. This is really fun. Uh, I love like bullet hell like roguelike games like this. Like this shit's pretty crazy. And also, if you decide to check this game out on your own, tell me what uh what kind of stuff did you choose as far as like you know what kind of power ups was you down with? What, what was you thinking was the way to go? Maybe you opted for the axe, which I keep avoiding because I kind of like these knives, to be honest. And I don't know, I didn't see the description fast enough. I don't know if the axe is going to enable me to shoot it like in whatever direction I'm facing or not. Yo. Oh, I can even add the whip. Oh, you can even add the other people's like weapons and stuff. Okay. Uh, I kind of like the King Bible. Let's do the King Bible. Yo, what's up? What's up? What's up now? Huh? What's up now? I don't care about you. I don't care about you. I am a vampire survivor, son. Yo, it's turkey just like Castlevania. Give me that health, son. Or ham, whatever the hell it is. Actually, by the way, it is ham. For someone that absolutely loves Castlevania, like, I discovered that, uh, sometime back, uh, in a episode of Angry Video Game Nerd, shout out to James Rolf, one of my favorite YouTube content creators, he actually said that in the instruction manual in the original Castlevania, believe it or not, that big ass thing that you collect that seriously looks like a turkey, that's actually a piece of ham. A guy is a big ass piece of ham, y'all. I'm just saying, like, if I had a piece of ham like that, like, during Thanksgiving or something, I don't know what to do with myself. Oh, here we go with this crap. Here we go with this crap. Uh-uh, son. Uh-uh, son. Come on. Yo! Get out of here! Oh, dude, I'm gonna need you to drop dead. Yo, my dude. Yo, how much health do you have? There we go. Woo! Yo, I got it. Praying Mantis is chasing after me, too. This is crazy. Yo, do I have like a. I don't know, do I have like a special button? Uh, I do not. Okay. You're getting all that, son. Reduces incoming damage by one. Fires one more protection. You know what? We're, we're going. We're going for it. Let's get that third. Let's get that third knife, y'all. Yo, I gotta be on the lookout for them sneaky ass bat waves again. In the comments, please, someone let me know what the hell is a, a gathering of bats or whatever you would call it. I think it's a flock of bats. I don't know. I mean, they, you know, they refer to other species of um, 
birds as a flock of bats. Oh, I mean, as a flock, right? Like a flock of geese, or is that? No, that's a gaggle of geese. Lord, you know what the hell you're talking about, Chubb. Act like you know about the animal kingdom or something. Oh, no shit. Oh, my dude. Well, we know what our next, uh, hell they call that thing? What basically the achievement is. Survive for 10 minutes. You guys think I can survive for 10 minutes? Whoa! Yeah, I think we're gonna... We're gonna finish this one out. I don't really need to do that. Oh, whoa, they are starting to really close in on me. We're gonna finish this run out and, uh... We'll, we'll call it for this episode, but man, this game is pretty tight. It's pretty fun. Whoa, all these bats! Again, whatever a uh, group of bats is called, it's a lot of them! Bro, my health just got wrecked. Oh, hey, 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 baby! Come on now. Come on now. Yeah, what's up now, bats? What's up now, bats? Assholes! Uh, damage high, Eris, going short, whatever. Let me get all of that. Yo, that power up me to last just a little bit longer. Oh, I got it. Oh, with the juke move, son. You see me thread the needle. Woo! Threading the needle, son. I'll take that. And that. And get out of here. And out of here. Oh, threading the needle again. I need all those. I need, uh, there's some bats. Uh, well, I don't know what the hell that is. A demon bat? I don't know what that is. Um, I need, I'll take that. Oh, there it is. Treasure! Oh, hey, this must be a good one. We got the bow, 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 Oh, bro, is that um, whew, almost a thousand gold, baby? All right. Oh, dude, I got everything to level two. Come on, game. You got nothing for rewards? You got nothing for rewards. Y'all better just stop. You better just quit while you're ahead. I'm, I'll be on this game for 10 minutes. <laughs> be on here for 300 minutes. Give me that, give me that. Oh yeah, you're gonna give me all that. Max health, generate damaging zones, King Bible lasts longer. We're gonna go with max health. So let's do that. Oh, dude. dirty, dirty thing. Dude. Bro, I got what I got. Four. Four knives coming out. I got double whip action. I got two Bibles. I'm wreck I'm wrecking shit, bro. I'm straight wrecking shit. Okay, I need that though. I hope that's all. Oh man, I can't. Bro. Bro! No 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 no! Thread the needle! Oh yeah, I need that! I need that! Every bit of that. Thanks. Yo, yo, bats, no, stop it, oh my god, dude, those things are beefy as shit, I wonder, like, what's the deal with why that one's colored, is he like a special one that like drops like a power up or something, oh, I need that, I need every bit of that, treasure found, baby, So upgrade to the dagger. So I'm gonna keep the five now. Yep. Thanks. Is that five? Bro, these things are beefy as shit. Oh my god. Come on, kill that. Kill that. Oh my god, bro. Thread the needle. 
Yo, are you for real right now? Oh my god. Oh my god, look at all these enemies! I'm dead! I'm so dead! Ah! Game over! Destroy 20 light sources. Hey, well, come on, let's get another achievement. Lancet. Find an aura lotion. Aura lotion. Okay. Survive 10 minutes with any character. You knew we were going to get that. Garlic. Find five floor chickens. Okay, they're actually chickens in this game. Cool. Man, I'm getting achievements left and right, y'all. Peach one. Survive 10 minutes with any character. Yep. Yo, this is a achievement smorgasbord. For real? Fire wand. Destroy 20 light sources. All right. Alrighty, well, I think for now we're going to be done, but uh, Vampire Survivors, man, digging it, like it, uh, bullet hell mixed with like a roguelike, uh, some Castlevania kind of elements going on there, uh, with like the characters and stuff, some of the power-ups, digging it, like it a lot, and uh, we'll be returning back to this, so make sure you guys, you know, are keeping it locked here at Lawrence's Let's Plays for additional content involving Vampire Survivors and some other games. Spooky Lou, you did good. This was a good choice, my brother. Very good choice. Loving this game. Uh, to my, you know, <clears throat> to those of you guys um, that enjoyed the video, uh, make sure that you do give a big old thumbs up uh, to uh, en enable YouTube to push this video out uh, through uh, to as many people as possible. They might hop on this video and decide they like it as well. Maybe they decide to give a you know, indie game like Vampire Saviors or Survivors a chance. And I got nothing really left to say, guys. This has been Lawrence for Lawrence's Let's Plays, and I am out of here. And I will see you next time. Take care, everybody.